So let's just talk about the rig I'm using at the moment. It's, uh, as I said, a short, short line nymph rig. No fly line extended beyond the fly rod. And there's no indicator. Uh, that's just a, a couple of pieces of high visibility nylon. And that's uh, basically what I'm using as my sight. It's given me an idea of, of where the flies are in the stream and how they're fishing. The heaviest uh, fly is the polyphytus fly. I've described that before. Um, this is the fly that has a, a tungsten bead mounted on a pin, which is lashed to the hook, whipped to the hook at a 45 degree angle. The fish is nice and deep. And the catching fly, which is the middle dropper, have to be good to get that one cameraman is um, a small caddish pupae one of my own clients these are on nice barbless patterns nice uh, napeg barbless hooks and this is ideal sort of water the water uh, just up ahead of me here these are the sort of streamy deep streamy areas where I'll be looking to fish these short line techniques on a small stream like this of course on a bigger river we'll be using uh, a longer rod, usually 10 feet, and often if we're check nymphing, we'll be using three flies. Uh, this style I'm using today is more similar to Polish nymphing in that I'm fishing it predominantly upstream um, because this river is rather too small to fish check style, which is uh, in front of the rod, in front of your so really on a smaller stream like this we're looking to fish upstream on a larger river with deeper faster currents we can fish in front of us check style so let's give the technique